Welcome back to my channel. I'm Joel Kellen, and today I'm just going to do a really short modification of my Michael Myers mask. Uh, I originally got it from Spirit Halloween. It was a pretty good mask. It was based on the 2018 version, but I didn't like that there were no any like blackout eye holes. So I'm going to rectify that by adding in my own. Now, I do remember back during one of my college classes last year, uh, one of my teachers helped me out in figuring out how to blacken out the eyes in that one video I made a while ago where I dressed up as uh, Michael Myers and just walked around my house. And he showed me how to like fix the colors on the suit as well as uh, on my skin and also in blacking out uh, the eyes for the entire thing. But I want to take it a step further and just... Uh, and just blacken out the eyes practically. Okay, so I got uh, the pieces cut out and I had recently gotten this original tacky glue. So hopefully it works. Alrighty, and now I got uh, both of them in. So now all I really can uh, do is just wait. All right, so it's been a few hours. Uh, I think the glue has dried off pretty well. Uh, I'll be honest, like <laughs> there actually wasn't much modification. All I did was just uh, glue some uh, black fabric onto here, some. Now it looks like uh, that you can't really see my fingers. Uh, I will admit, like I did do it a little bit crudely. This, this is what the uh, uh, this is what the eye holes uh, look like uh, from the inside. But you know what? People aren't gonna look at it. Uh, I'm in my blue mechanics uh, jumpsuit that I got for a Michael Myers costume. Uh, so I guess now I, now all I really gotta do is just. Uh, test it out. Oh, geez, I can't believe I'm last. But that's really it uh, for uh, this video. All I all I really did was just um, use a black cotton nylon fabric, and then I used um, I used Aline's original kind of tacky glue to um, to stick it on there, and that that's how I got the blackout uh, eye holes. So that was really kind of it for the, uh, this video. Um, when uh, the movie Halloween Kills uh, comes closer uh, this October, I might consider uh, trying to modify the mask to make it look like the burned version that we've been seeing in the trailers. Uh, but I'd have to look up exactly how to how to do that without like completely destroying the mask itself. But other than that, that's really it uh, for this mask. Uh, I will be using uh, that same uh, fabric and the same glue for when I eventually uh, work on my Jason Voorhees mask. 
uh, so far this is just like a two three dollar uh, plastic hockey mask that I got from Menards but once I modify it it's gonna look uh, a little bit closer to the hockey mask that Jason wears uh, when I get to that I I don't really know hopefully by the end of uh, this year because I got this uh, I got a couple other uh, projects uh, going on uh, some of which are involved uh, with video editing, some of which are involved with uh, stuff similar to this. But other than that, that's real, uh, really it. If you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, and I will catch you guys later.